thought we had lost you, Eivor. For good this time. A warm welcome as always, Ranvi. You look like red and shit. What happened? Nothing to crow about. Except to say the men who delayed us are dead. And how are you? Well enough. Though I have spent many tiresome days calming the rages of our king. He is not happy with you. I expected as much. And what of Sigurd? Has he returned from his raids? My husband should be home today. The last we heard, he was approaching Stavanger. Good to hear. We have need of his courage. Sigurd will not save you from his father's wrath, Eivor. You should know that by now. Did your raid not go as planned? They rarely go as planned. We killed many of Kjotve's warriors. And there was this. My father's axe among the dead. Ah. After so many years. You should take it to Gunnar. He will give it back its edge. A good idea. After I see our king. That I do not advise. Not yet. He is meeting with a messenger from the north. I can wait. A cloud hangs over you. Is something wrong? Seeing my father's axe after 17 winters. It stirred something in me. A feeling I have not had since. Since the day he was killed. Since the day I got this. Memories of past agonies. Of sadness and pain. I should speak with Volka. She could help me make sense of my... My feelings. Take your time getting settled. I will see you at the Longhouse. I think you have lost your edge, Eivor. Just like that axe. Maybe Gunnar can help you with both. I will let you know. Eivor! Looking rough you are. Welcome home. Eivor! Did you bring us I any treasure? I return with a boat and a full crew. That is worth more than silver. That doesn't count. You need silver. And jewels. <laughs> shut up, Rolf. How do you know? You never went on a raid. You shut up. Caught anything? Not today. The fish aren't biting. Too many passing boats churning the water. I lack the patience for pole fishing. I would have better luck with my bow. Shooting fish with a bow? That could work. Caught anything? Not today. The fish aren't biting. I lack the patience. Shooting fish with... Well, look who it is. Practicing your wordplay, Alvis. Ah, Eivor! <laughs> the only mouth in Midgard from which I fear mockery. You told me the art of writing poetry, old friend. It is only natural that I surpass you soon. How about another lesson, then? A quick flight. Right here, right now. What do you say? Let's try flighting. I always put a few coins down as a wager. Most of those who enjoy flighting have an equal fondness for betting. But today, we'll abstain. Let me begin. I'm ready. In flighting, it's key to match cadence and rhyme. It's as much about sound as it is about time. So be careful in choosing the words that you say. You're a very fine teacher. I'm sure I'll excel. Interesting. You have the cadence correct, but you failed the rhyme. Now, let us examine meaning. <clears throat> In flighting, you'll need to be cutting and keen. It's about wielding wit more than venting your spleen. If I tell you you're foolish and stupid and dull...
Then I tell you you've nothing inside of your skull. Eh, hey, a good response. I called you stupid and you turned it around. Fighting about wit, you matched my meaning. When you think of too many perfect retorts, use the one that best matches the meaning. Last one. So go then and conquer the world with your wit. Go be clever, be quick, show your spirit and grit. I look eagerly forward to seeing how you fare. I will flight you with flourish and best you with flair. Perfect, yes! <laughs> you could destroy me with such a line. Your flighting's astounding, you're worthy of praise. You swing a fine axe and you turn a good phrase. Thank you, Elvis. I'll take the lesson to heart. Ben, have you designed any new tattoos? A few worth looking at. Let me have a look. Go ahead.
Is there something else? See you later, Sven. Sure. Eivor, come to keep your blade sharp? Wolf kissed. Welcome back. Garner, I have something here you might like to see. Thunderclap of Thor! Is that your father's axe? I have not seen his beauty since, well, for some time. I forged this weapon long ago. Still looks good. One of my finest, I think. It has a blunted blade, but it swings well. Can you sharpen it? I can give it a better edge and reinforce the handle. And as luck would have it, I have one ingot left for the job. Are you sure? The fates have will it so. But in future, bring your own metal ingots. I cannot forge them from empty air. That should do it. Anything else? And how are you, Gunnar? Holding up? Yeah, work is good and my spirits are strong, but my nights are newly cold. My lady left me, if you have not heard. I had. Sorry to hear it. You were together how long? Uh, five weeks it was. Five beautiful, passionate weeks. But all that is done. Will I never find my Brunhilde? Valkyries do not walk the world as they once did, Gunnar. Maybe set your sights a bit lower. Lower? My friend, look at my wares, my weapons. I'm not a man to settle for less than the finest of anything.
need anything else? That is all for now. Return any time. They must be finished now. But if you have any other business, it may be wise to do it now. Let him cool down. I could speak to Volka first. Get this weight off my mind. The king is not going anywhere. Hey, do. Come here now. No one who will go around with me? Come and drink! Let us amuse the gods! Is there no one who will go around with me? All right, Tekla. I'll out drink you.
Hvað viltu í eilinn? Gull, silfur, mat og dreitt auðvitað. En hvað fleira? Það var gott trist. Ég man að hann blitt öndur mannsins best við fór. Hann var kýmlegur sem hann stóð í blóði og þarf að gangi í sér á armann. Já, já, beiðum nú eigi gullan bosta að sá gullnum akkarnum. Að einu nokkum dregnum vári sjónum sumarið leikinn meins. Þegast meir í lið neyðið það að það nýtt að það er það er frýð jám fleiri að nýtið til að gera skildi til að það er líkur mér og glókir líkur fór. Ég hygg allan dag að þið fór stöður. Þeima. Ellið tekur segjum fyrir sýn og... Kom en drink! This is a muse the gods! Ég hygg að hann segjum ekki annat. Ekki að ræli mér hann með þessa að vera bandingar sem þeir sáli hann. Is there no one who will go around with me? Munni Þórður vilja hafa brauðsleif eða tvá að pressa hann skipi. Þegir hann að kenni sér að vann eftir mánuð á um þess og tannholt hans verkir. Come and drink! Let us amuse the gods! Hey Tekla, what is brewing? Alvis tells me this brew is too strong. Think you can handle a few rounds? Eru sveinarnir? Munni fiska við uppsprettunum. Kvæmi eigi aftur bráðlega munni að fara að finna þá. Think you can match horns with me? Like Odin, mead is my lifeblood. That was well drunk. Well done. Well drunk done. Come and drink. Let us amuse the gods. All right, Tekla. I'll out drink you. <laughs> Welcome. This is available for purchase. A smart purchase. I can fetch this if you want. Smart to buy these. That all you need? I have to go. See you soon. Mondur, it appears your ship is like one of Holger's stories. Never quite finished. <laughs> Get me some decent wood and I can finish it in a week. But Styrbjorn won't gift me any. There was a little plunder at Avalsnes, but if I come across any, it'll be yours.
Kate is is there the no one who will go around with me? This land will never Who would like to hear a story? Who would land? enjoy a tale of the gods? There has always been war. Hey, can you point me to some good hunting grounds? I could, but I don't want every iron foot with a bow scaring away the game. Bring me three deer antlers to prove your skills, and I might just have a story for you. A worthy challenge. I'll see you soon. Not had to win all day. I must turn this around. I do miss the rattling of luck bones. Or luck, a game of skill, or luck. <laughs> How about a game? Let us play. I am pretty good. Do not say I did not warn you. Hey, come here, come now. will do.
Interesting. Almost got you now. Good game. The gods favored your hand to day. Shall we go again? Another time, perhaps.
Tovi. Trading a needle for an arrow, I see. Eivor, can you teach me the art of archery? I'll be happy to. Siam standing? Plant your feet in the ground, no wider than your shoulders. Breathe in as you draw the arrow back. Look at the point you want to hit, and now imagine the arrow passing straight through it and far beyond. Breathe out, then release. Thank you, Eivor. Now I have something for you. See? All in the eye. Thank you, Eivor. As a gift, I could design a new tattoo for you. Something to decorate your scar. A kind offer. But I want this scar visible. Oh, I did not mean to offend. In any case, I do have a tattoo for you. Stretch your wings, Sunan. 